today we are going to talk about maintenance for stock group and also stock item. First, we go to stock, maintain stock group. If this is a handful company, we have already created a few type of grouping. Let's say accessory, handful, prepaid, service charge. Okay, let's say for accessory, <coughs> you can insert your code and description. Same thing, you can assign your costing method by grouping either fixed cost, first in, first out, or weather average. Other than this, if you have different type of sales account, you can assign your sales code by grouping, let's say sales accessory. Other than sales code, you can also setting your cash sales, sales return, purchase, cash purchase, and purchase return code, then save. Now, Continue to stock item. We go to stock, maintain stock item. All these are your item listing. And also, you can check your balance quantity from here. This is live update. Let's create a new item. Let's create a new item. Okay, let's say iPhone 6. We put IP6. The code must be unique and alphanumeric are acceptable. Let's say description iPhone 6. Okay, we have to assign the grouping and base UOM, mean unit of measurement. What is the purchase cost and what is your selling price? Okay, other than this, start from 1st April. System will preset SR for output tax and TX for input tax. If this is a standard tax code, this is a standard tax item, you have to just leave it blank. System will assign accordingly. Or if this is a non standard tax item, you have to assign your output tax and input tax accordingly. Other than this, system allow you to create more than one UOM. Let's say we press on the plus button per carton. Let's say one carton is 12 unit. What is the reference cost and reference price per carton? And also, you can set your minimum price to avoid your salesperson sell below your minimum price. Other than this, you can also do all this setting. If this is a non-stock control item. You have to just untick this. Let's say, few years later. If we are not selling this item anymore, right? System do not allow us to delete due to transaction assisting. But we can inactive this item by untick it and save. We can do setting under tools, option, unique price to set stock item reference price as first priority by just highlight on it and press on the arrow up key and choose apply when available. Other than this, you can also set your last sales invoice selling price to second priority if system file reference price is empty and press on OK. Thank you.